And all right, welcome back, everyone, to some more Infinifactory. I've, I'm kind of curious what the symbol is. They haven't really told me. It's just a symbol. It's just a symbol. I mean, it kind of looks like a backward B with some lines. I don't know. Whatever. We're doing the small excavator. Small excavator. All right, what are we looking at here? This looks like a pain in the ass waiting to happen. Actually, you know what? It doesn't look that bad. Looks like it might be kind of a pain in the ass. What are you? Oh, we got a dead body. We'll check that in a second. You're the middle thing. Okay. And then you're the other input. We're gonna need a lot of those, and not that many of those. Someone someone told me that apparently sometimes the inputs aren't always the same. Yeah, see, look at that. So many are popping out there and, and only a couple there. I'm betting that there are exactly the ratio, right? So you've got three, and then six, and then seven, eight, nine, ten. So I'm betting that for every ten of these, one pops out of that. That would make sense. But I guess we'll find out. I'm going to go ahead and uh, do this as I think. As I think on this puzzle. there for me in Greenville, huh? A farm? Maybe. Forty years on the back of a tractor? That wasn't the kind of life I wanted anyway. I've seen the stars. Been to hundreds of different planets. I've lived with aliens. But no one knows. Not even my parents. Oh, my, my parents are probably dead now. <sighs> It's strange, I've never really missed human contact. I was always a bit of a loner anyway. But I'd, I'd like someone to talk to now. The overlords gave me books and records, you know. Forgot the record player, but that's okay. I made my own. They kept me comfortable. I finished up a while ago, but I can't get back to the ship. I'm tired. So tired. Maybe I'll just sit down here and wait for them to pick me up. <sighs> the sky's clear now. <laughs> the stars are all different from Earth, but they still shine. Lovely. I'll just close my eyes for a bit. Yeah. Just, just for a moment. Well, that's nice, and this did not work the way I anticipated it probably would have. So, <laughs> there's that. Great. I guess we're, we're doing it this way. Which is fine. It's not like any way is better than another way. Isn't that right, YouTube commenters who tell me I do these puzzles wrong? Snarling at me and shit. Alright, well, there you go. There's that. And we'll do that. And then we'll do... So, my, my kind of my thought is there's two ways to do this. I can either do the left side and then do the right side. Well, I mean, I, I do one side and then I just slip it for the other side. And then I just have them meet each other where this guy will end up being. Or I could do the bottoms and then do the top and have them all come together. Doing the bottoms and then the top would, would end up having more pieces, more, more um, like conveyors and stuff, more splitters. But I think it actually makes more sense to do. So I, I guess we'll... That's, that's how I'm going to do it. I'm going to do the bottom, and then I'm going to do the top. And we'll just kind of see how that ends up working out. Yeah. Yeah. That's what we're going to do right there. What I just said. Okay. So this guy is going to end up being one of the top pieces. And it's going to need to be rotated. Uh, we might as well just do that right uh, right here, I guess. So that's going to rotate this way, and then we're going to have this right here. Uh, and then we'll go ahead and rotate it again. Uh, yeah, that may actually not work the way I just did it. Let's see. That uh, still worked. Cool. I was kind of expecting it to do something weird since it was actually kind of going back. But that works, it kind of self-propels itself. Alright, so then we've got that. I kind of want that to split into two. 
So, uh, instead of these, let's go ahead and do this. And then, I can't have a sensor there. That actually isn't going to work. Never mind. That does not work. We will do it afterward then. We'll do it uh, right here. Bam, bam, bam. Bam. And then we need we need these to split, so we're going to have our sensor with a conveyor, which is, well, with a pusher, rather, right there. And then obviously connect those. And these will go on their merry way down here. Make sure this works the way I, I anticipate. Bam. Great. And so... Did I just tell it to rotate these twice? I'm an idiot. Okay, hold on. Let's, we gotta scrap all this now, because it's gonna be in the wrong spot. We just want it to rotate one time. One time is enough. That's really funny that I tried to do it that way. Actually. I think it's funny. But... Maybe it's not funny. Maybe I just have a really bad sense of humor. Probably the case. Alright, and then we get those together. Now we're, we're looking good, right? <laughs> no, we're not. We're not looking good. That, that should do it, right? I think. You son of a bitch. So wait. Really? That's how that works? How do I get it to just be one over? Huh. Oh, I just pulled my headphones right out of my ears. Great. Alright. Hold on. Hmm. That is, uh... Interesting, because here's the thing. If I do it the other way, it pulls input from this side. But if I do it this way, it pulls input from this side. That is odd. To say the least. Well, you know what? The easy solution to this is to simply do it again. Let's do it again. Get that out of here. Bam, bam. Uh, actually, we don't need to be doing it that way. Because it's rotated now. That's something I didn't think through entirely before. Yeah. Alright, and then we've got two of them. And I need them to land in such a way that this guy is already kind of in there. I need this guy to already be kind of in there. Uh. So, we'll set it up so everything aligns with this one here on the left. So if I do that, then it needs to be, it needs to be right there. So that's actually, that's perfect. Right where it is. This guy can find itself coming right down there. Yeah. Right down there. And then you... We're gonna work on your positioning a little bit. Is that is that it? Is that right? Is that correct? Oh no, that's actually not good. That's not good. We need one more rotatey thingy right there. Bam. Um, actually, it would make sense to do two more of those there. Is that right now? It would be if. Ooh. Okay. Hmm. Okay, so here's the problem. We've got two problems. A, this guy is here way too early, which we can easily fix. And B, this guy is here too early because it's, it's going to push him through. Okay. So this is one solution to the first problem right there. Now we need to make this guy take longer. Um, which I don't know that I want to do it like that. Um, actually, we can just do this. Which I'm sure everyone on the internet is going to get pissy at me for. Alright, now that one is there first. Boom. And then those will weld right there. And then that will be... That needs to be higher. Okay, that's this whole thing needs to be higher. That's fine. That's easy to do. All 
we'll just uh, do it up here. I do not at all remember the spacings, but we'll figure them out again. We will figure it out again. I'm just guessing that that's right. I don't. I don't actually know because. I think that's right. No! No, they need to be one more over. Alright, so those are higher up, and then we need to weld them. No. Just like that. Bam, bam, bam. Alright, I just want to make sure this whole thing works properly, because I'm a visual thinker. Boom! And then, hopefully at this point we will have already... We can't. Actually, we, we need these guys down here first. Oh no, that's right. I don't know what I was doing there. So is this guy... Hold on, how is this cut block coming down here? Is he just getting pushed along? He's just getting pushed along. Okay. We don't want that to happen. We want him to be down there a little sooner. Um... He needs to be one lower. I'm referring to them as he and she for some reason. I don't know why. Alright, I'm just kind of thinking, how am I going to get... I need both of them down here, actually. Which actually might mean I need to move this whole thing over a little bit. That's a, that's a possibility that we need to do that. Um... Let me just get this whole thing aligned. So let me... Let me do it like that. I don't know why I did it like... <sighs> Get out of here. Really? That's how you chose to do that? Alright, well. So that'll be aligned. Is that even the right rotation? What's the rotation this comes out as? That is... Incorrect. That is incorrect. Let us fix your rotation, sir. Alright, so we'll, we'll do... Okay. We'll do one. And then the other one is going to have to, like... It's going to have to be out there, actually. It's kind of going to have to... It's going to be like that. Those connect. Okay. And then we'll rotate it one more time right here. And then what's the, what does this give? Of course, of course, great. So we're. We're actually going to have to split these off into two, somehow. Um, Alright, let's see. You know what? Before I do anything else, let's go ahead and redo this over farther. So we'll do, we'll do, uh, we'll do this. We'll do, we'll do this. Hmm. I wonder if the timings are still going to make any sense at all. Uh, we can move it over by one now. I think I think we're, we're over far enough, right? Yeah, we're over far enough. And then this guy... Rotate yourself in. Right there. Uh, hmm. Okay. Let's not do that. It looks like the timings are a little close. No, they work. Yeah, they work. Alright. Great. Perfect. Exactly what I ever could have hoped for. Nailed that. Okay. And then this guy, this has to split off somehow, so I guess what we can probably get away with doing is this come out the right way. This comes out like that, so we'll just do one of these. 
And then we'll do our basic piston splitter here with one of these. Like so. This'll this will go off in its own special That's not gonna get oh, that doesn't work. That doesn't work. That makes sense that that wouldn't work either. Yeah, that makes perfect sense. Well, no problem. Move all of this over by one. Yes. Including that. Which, of course, doesn't work. All right. Bam. This one will not be rotated. It is just going to naturally form its position. Right, I, I guess like right... So if that guy's getting pulled over, we need it... Yeah, right here. Right there. That's what we need. We need it to sit right there. And this one too. It needs to sit right there. And is that going to actually work out? Does that fit in that correctly? No, it doesn't. No, it does not. That's fine. That's perfectly fine. I think that works. Leaving that space there. Alright. So then we have that, and then we just gotta wait for this to get sucked on over. Uh. Hmm. I don't think this works, but it might work. Boom. Okay, and then, how do I weld those together? Is it... We can do whatever we want down in this area right here, I think. Alright, let me see what space we have available. I think it's just like these in the, in the middle, these three. Yeah, we have those three available. Um, so if we do it... Oh, we don't have up welders. Alright, so I do one to the one to the side. And then one well we we can do one from above. We can do them from above. So if we do this and then like this. Which of course makes no sense. But at the same time, we can do this. Which I think kinda gets them all. Right? I guess we'll find out. I guess we will find out. Alright, and then we, we just need to connect these to the ground somehow. So let's just, you know what? We'll do. Uh, can I not pull and drag? Oh no! I'm putting down the wrong thing. No wonder I can't do it. Uh, what even was my plan here? Oh my gosh, this looks terrible. Pretty sure it was like that. Right? Is that correct? That looks horribly incorrect. But th that would work though, I think. Let's try that. I think I think this is different than the way I just had it set, but whatever. Uh, we just need to connect that to something. Now I know this isn't gonna work, they need to be propelled forward somehow. Oh! Those weld too early. Those weld too early. Okay. Alright. Well, let's try getting rid of them on this side. Bam. Oh. Okay. So how do I weld these guys without it happening that early? It happens too early. Hmm. The ones on the left are fine. Those, those would work. Those would always work. I feel like the only way to do it is to have this guy show up later than the other ones. Which... Is that something we can do? I mean, I... Well, I don't know. I don't know if we have enough space to, to do that. I'm, I'm kind of thinking about spacing here. I don't know that that is something we can do. Because if I push... if I can't replace these with, with solid blocks. It's not gonna work. If I just replace these two, what's gonna happen? 
I think this kind of messes up how my timings... Yeah, see that? Exactly. Exactly, that's what happens. Yeah, no, this needs to be like that. Okay. Let's see this again. It needs to show up afterward. See, and these ones show up afterward because they have enough space to just dick around. This one really doesn't. Unlo you know what, though? Yeah, I can. Yeah, I can. <laughs> okay, so if I do this, right, but I have it send it that way, and then I do this, and send, oh, I'm doing this all wrong, uh, I send it that way, right, and then it just kind of delays it a little bit. That might, that might work. That it's possible, but just to play it safe, we'll do it, we'll do it this way instead. I'll get rid of these two. That need, that needed to be there. Whatever, we'll do that. Alright, we'll do that. And then that's not going to work. We need that. And then, I'm trying to, to see if I can fit in four of them. That, and then. And it does not work. That does not cover it. Although, you know what, that by itself might do it. Is that, I don't know if that's gonna work. I don't know if that's... You know what? Let's try it. Let's try it. It's this amazing thing where we try something new and see if it works. It's this amazing revolutionary concept. I think I think they're going to weld too early, but... Damn it! They weld just barely too early. Okay. Well... We, we can have it start doing weird stuff earlier. All right, so let me get all this off. Pretty sure we can make this work. All right, so we do that. And then we need two blocks down. Uh, and we do that. This, this works, right? I have this all set up properly. No. No, I don't. No, I do not. Why? Why? Shouldn't it work? Hmm. It's too... It's too early. This one right here. Alright, and then those go that way. One more. I think this is like not even remotely the most efficient way to do this, but I think this works. Uh, <laughs> except for that part right there. That didn't work. Um, so wait, hold on. What, what happened there? It's just too close to the wall. Okay, that's fine. That's perfectly fine. We can we can work with that. I believe. No. Oh, that does create a whole other issue. It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter that we get there. At that time. Okay, hold on. What if I get rid of this? No, because it's always going to connect to the front one. It's always going to connect to the front one. Interesting. Interesting. Okay. A solution to that. A solution to that. Would have to be. 
something. It's gonna be something. How do I get it to only weld them once they're all there? Can you push a welder? Is that a thing? Uh, you know what? I really kind of feel like I need to know if that's a thing. Okay, hold on. Let me try this. Let me, let me, let me try something. Let me put a sensor right here to detect when it's all the way forward. Um, and then, this is a really wonky solution to this, but... Let me then connect that to a... A welder right here. A welder right here. Which would then be pushed by the pusher, but only when being sensed. by this guy. Right, so it only well, bam, it would it would only go then. But it, it didn't work. That actually did not work at all. Why didn't that work? I feel like that should have worked. That did not Oh no! That would have been the solution. It doesn't push. It doesn't push oh man. Why doesn't it push a welder? It should push a welder. Like, is it just me? I feel like it should 100% be pushing this welder. Okay. Well then, that didn't work. Let's scrap that entire idea. It was a really good idea, in my opinion. In my opinion, that idea was solid. Okay. Then... Hmm. God, it'd be nice to make it so you can move a block upward, and then I could have the top one just fall from above. But you can't move a block upward. There's no way to do that. There's no upward pushing or anything like that. There's no ramp conveyor. There are a ton of blocks in this game that would make it more interesting. Okay. I need to I need to visualize again. I need to be visualizing. Hmm. Okay. So if those ones are all in place, it works. But because that one comes from the side, it doesn't. So if I make that come from anywhere but the side, it could potentially work, right? I just need this to not come from the side. I can have it come from the back. Yes, 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 yes. Okay, I'll get rid of all this. That was a terrible idea. I mean, it was it, it, it did what I needed it to do. It was just... I was needing it to do the wrong thing. Alright, so... If I want this guy to come from the back... It always triggers using the f farthest conveyor, so... I think, anyway. So I need this to actually go forward one more, which I can't do. Which means I have to move the whole thing over again. Oh my gosh. Game. This is this is terrible. Okay. We're doing it. We're moving the whole thing over some more. It's fine. It'll work. We'll just move it all the way over here. Actually, yeah, that'll work. That'll work. We can move it all the way over there. And then have it conveyor from there. Which may be overkill, but you know what? It doesn't matter. Alright, and then we need to move these. No, that's wrong. That still may be wrong. I think it's supposed to be over one more. We'll see, though. We'll see. One of these is going to be right, and one of these is going to be wrong. But they both work. No. Alright, we'll do that. We'll set it up the exact same way as previously. Again, this is like the third time I've done this. But that's fine. Alright, and then we'll have it come from the back. From over here. Right? In theory, anyway. 
Of course, that's in the wrong way, but I just want to make sure this guy's going to go at the right time. No. It needs to be here. No. It needs to be here. Okay, now all I need is for this guy to come from the right side. Okay. So this guy kind of comes in over the, that makes sense. Okay. Oh, wrong thing. Wrong thing. Like that. It kind of comes in there. And that. Oh, but it has nothing to push it all the way through. How do I get it to go all the way through? Oh, man. Mm. How do I get it to go all the way through? Is that... Is there any space for that? Oh, right, right down the middle, of course. Right down through here. Oh, wait. That needs to be one higher. That was right beforehand. Right down here, I'm pretty sure we can just convey the whole thing right on through, right? right on through to victory. No? Okay, pause. Why? Because it never actually hits this conveyor. So, we'll just simply do that. We can actually get rid of all of this. Um, probably, I'm going to just reset up all of that. So I just want to make sure this actually sucks the whole thing through. Of course that pushed me. Alright, so it does, and then I believe all we need to do then is have some welders up top. If I'm thinking about this correctly, right? Like... No. But, if I, if I have some, yeah, like right here. No, because then that's in the way. That is totally in the way. Does this, does this work, or is something, I feel like something is going to be in the way. Of course, I was in the way. No! What did you produce? It did it too early, didn't it? Oh, well, it deletes the object. Well, let's try that again so I can see what happened, because it deleted my object. I think it just welds it too early. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Same problem I was having before. Or it welds it too early. So I just put them right there, right? Right? Right game? Let's put them right there. I think. I still haven't worked out propelling the thing through properly. So does does it just time out? It just works. It just works. Oh my god. And I, I don't have any other conflict or anything, right, that messes me up? No, I think we did it. I think I... Woo! Oh my god, I think this is like the longest episode I've done thus far. You know what? It was a good episode. It worked. It worked. Oh my gosh, yes. My cycle score was, was, is relatively good, I think. I think that's a good score. It's, you know what? It's slightly less than average. It's about average. And that, you know what? That works for me. I have no, I have no problem with that. That is, that is perfect. I couldn't have asked for a better puzzle. Thank you. I believe I have a little bit of a performance review. Let's go ahead and... Hi. I think it would be cool if they made the mon the aliens a little bit more mysterious. Like, they're kind of going with, like, the silly kind of thing going where... Where, I mean... They're, they're, it's just, they're funny, right? They shouldn't be funny. I think they should be, like, ominous and mysterious, and you don't know what you're dealing with, and you never actually see them, but you're supposed to craft things for them. We got a hat. Oh, wow. Oh. I think that's a new... Uh, this is a new...
Was that a new animation? I don't think we've seen that before. Let me put it on my wall of, of awesomeness here, my shelf of awesomeness. Yeah, so I think it'd be kind of cool for this game to have mysterious aliens that you don't really know anything about. I think that would be kind of nifty. Uh, when we come back, we're going to do uh, Production Zone 2, apparently. <laughs> I can't wait. I'll see you guys then.